Welcome to another episode of Philosophy and in today's episode, we're going to talk about what a fave or fab icon is. Now, the word fab icon or fave icon was derived from the words favorite icon, also known as a website icon, a tab icon, a bookmark icon, or even a URL icon. And this fab icon is the little image that you could find on a web browser when you're visiting a particular website. So for example, if you visit the website of Facebook, then you're gonna see the tiny icon with the little Facebook logo on it. And the mere function of a fab icon is really to identify on which tab and website you're visiting. A fab icon is merely just an addition to a great user experience on a particular browser. You could also find a fab icon when you bookmark a website and when you try to visit your bookmark list, then you could find several fab icons besides each link that you have bookmarked. A fab icon can also be found when you open up a browser and you haven't visited a website yet, but you're gonna find the recent websites that you have visited previously and you could find each of their icons laid out on the browser. A fab icon is really not a necessity, but really nice to have. And if you were to generate one for your own website, then you need to follow these simple guidelines when creating a fab icon for your website. And most of the time, websites generate fab icons in the form of their company logo, which fits on a browser tab. And the standard size of a fab icon is 16 pixels by 16 pixels. So it is highly recommended that your logo should be at least a perfect square with 16 by 16 pixels. You could also create a fab icon which is a little higher when it comes to pixels and resolution so that when it's compressed down to 16 by 16, it looks crispy, clean, and clear. So if you plan to build a website or you currently have a website that has no fab icon, then now at least you know what is the simple ways and the standard. This will help identify the website that every user is visiting, especially when they're browsing on multiple tabs. I'd like to thank you for watching this episode. I hope this educates you on the topic on hand. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Also that bell button to get notifications on the latest uploads I do every week. In the case you'll require a team or agency to build a website for you, don't forget to check out Mediafy.com. I have a bunch of web developers ready to build your website and we offer the best plans and packages for every website need that you'll require.